How long are patients hospitalized from receiving induction therapy? The first four weeks, patients spend in the hospital. So all of this work, work is happening while they're in the hospital. Um, chemotherapy, day 14 marrow, till day 28. Until their blood counts return back to normal, they are in the hospital. We only discharge patients once we are confident that they have enough immune system to fight infection. We keep them in the hospital for the four weeks because most of the time, you know, when you eliminate all cells, the risk of infection is so high, it's just impossible to actually be safe at home. Um, so that's why they're admitted. And even for the sort of what we call the older people regimen, like hypomethylating agents and venetoclax, they are technically being called lower intensity, but they're really not. They kind of, they do the same thing. They empty out the bone marrow, there's profound low blood counts, and they have a risk of infection. So many of my o older patients, um, although on the, these sort of lower intensity regimens, we keep them in the hospital the whole month because it's, uh, you know, it's actually harder for a, for a 70 year old patient to come to the clinic twice a week trying to get transfusions, risking infections, this and that. It's better to actually be in the hospital.